Welcome back to Notre Dame Day 2015. I'm Justine Ward and for my next guest we were planning to do a remote from a Notre Dame particle accelerator but the walls around it were four feet of solid concrete so we couldn't get a signal. So joining me in the studio now is Ani Abrahamian, Freeman Professor of Experimental Nuclear Physics. Welcome Professor and you know with my time at Notre much. Dame I didn't realize we actually have three particle accelerators on campus. Thank you very much, Justine. Um, we, in fact, have had uh, nuclear accelerators on campus since the early 1940s. Um, we're one of the earliest universities that had accelerators on campus. We're, in fact, the second university in the U.S. that had them at I, home. Yes, and <laughs> so, for, for layman's term, what exactly a, a particle accelerator does? Yeah, well, a particle accelerator is meant to do exactly that. So taking particles and accelerating them to faster speeds so that you can uh, basically get over the Coulomb barrier and um, penetrate a nucleus. So uh, make a nuclear reaction, make new nuclear products, more exotic nuclei that you can study in the laboratory. Um, and so breaking up atoms going on right here at Notre Dame. Yes. That so, is true. <laughs> so what kind of projects go on in the particle accelerator? Yeah, um, the main research in our nuclear science lab here on campus is on trying in, in, in nuclear astrophysics. We're trying to understand energy generation in the sun and how that works. Um, we know that a lot of the elements in the universe are made um, in stars. Mm -hmm. So we're trying to figure out where the energy is coming from and also where the neutrons are um, coming from that produce later on the heavier elements. So. And, and why does Notre Dame need a particle accelerator? What does it help us study or, or learn? Yeah. Uh, why do we need one? Well, <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure that's a complicated question. There's lots of reasons. <laughs> right. Um, the newest accelerator, which we just got through a very competitive process uh, through the National Science Foundation, it was a major research instrumentation grant to Notre Dame. It allows us to have much more intense beams than we did with the older accelerators, and we can do some of the hardest nuclear reactions that allow us to understand the very fine workings of the evolution of a star or the stellar evolution. So um, it's quite funny that uh, that kind of question has been asked since the beginning of nuclear science at Notre Dame since the, I think when they were building the first one in uh, 1930s, a student was asking um, a professor at that time, why do we need a nuclear, <laughs> well, he called it an atom smasher. Why do we need <laughs> an atom smasher? <laughs> so uh, there's a lot of challenges in studying nuclei, and uh, Notre Dame, where the nuclear astrophysics component has made us one of the best labs in the world. And a lot uh, of questions still to be answered. Right. And that's what we're working on here at Notre Dame. Right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, thank you so much, Professor, for joining us. Uh, we do have a quick commercial break, but we'll be right back after this.